Hello everyone! Today I have got another package of Anake bags. Now you know that I love these bags and I have got two different collection pieces here. So I'm going to open this one up and show you both pieces. Okay, so here are the bags and I'm going to show you just only the tiny one in this video because I think that this video is going to be quite long. So let's start with this one. Um, if you haven't heard about this kind of trademark, Anaka is a Spanish a company um, trademark. Um, all the bags are leather, they have got stationery, purses and different things. And you can see that everything is coming, a special yellow bag with the logo of the girl whose name is Anneke on it. And this is where you can keep your bag, not to have stains on it, because leather can have uh, stains if it is quite close to other leather goodies or not leather also, because, for example, jeans can have blue stains everywhere. Uh, I experienced it, so that's why I know. So this is what first you can see and you can use this also. It's very practical. I love this one. And inside you can have your bag. And what I have got today, ta dam ta dam ta dam ta dam, is this gorgeous little Anneke bag, which is coming from the Mademoiselle collection. And the main topic is Paris, as you can see. And wow, it's so cute! It's very really nice. and. Oh, guys, you could smell the leather smell. Oh my gosh, it's so, so, so good. I love this one. This also means that it's good quality when the smell is good. It's not just a mm, Chinese product, but wow. Okay, so let's see. Oh my gosh, where shall I start? It's so beautiful. So first, it is going to be a little bag and uh, I'm going to use this everyday use when uh, I have to wear something elegant in the school, when we have got a school ceremony or celebrations with uh, all the black and white uh, um, outfits. I think this is going to fit perfectly. And let's see. Okay, so we can start with all the details, I think, first. So... You can see that here is the little girl and her headband is an embroidered style with a little pearl here on her headband. She has got such a pretty face and this typical striped shirt. It's so French. <laughs> Very nice one. In the background you can see here the details of Paris, of course the Eiffel Tower. And by the way, in this collection I was searching something like this and I could only come across with those bags which have very nice French buildings but the Eiffel Tower is really tiny and you cannot even realize it when you first look at the bag. And I wanted to just shout at you that okay here is the Eiffel Tower and this is exactly my bag, it was meant to be mine, I know. And let's see, we have got her name also with little shiny pearls. And here is Tawanda. Tawanda is this little tiny cat and they are always together. And you can see also Paris with silver letters. Here is a little rose gold Anaka. Oh, Anaka. I don't know what is under it, but you can see. And here is also a very nice stone inside. And then here says also Mademoiselle and Unique, but I don't know how you say this one in French. Here you can also see with golden letters on this Bordeaux little tag that it says also Anneke. And let's see, these are all the things. And then this is one side, it's also rose gold and brown, but it looks a little bit Bordeaux. And the back you can see this very nice velvet material with this shiny silver. 
it's so poofy and very cool it's it reminds me of the um what did we have some chairs had this kind of uh, on the top and you could sit on it when i was a child and also gray bordeaux silver together and here you can see that we have got also this Anaka written here and these bags are coming with this keychain so I am going to remove this stuff um, my other bag didn't have but the normal bag it doesn't matter if it is a shoulder bag a smaller bag have got always this key holder it's a very nice detail of the bags and this one is coming I'm quite surprised that we have got this pom-pom <laughs> very nice huge red pom-pom what I don't really understand that why do we have this one and not an Eiffel Tower um, but luckily I have got an Eiffel Tower keychain what I bought exactly under the Eiffel Tower when we were queuing up um, a few years ago and I'm going to put that one here so you can see that there's also a bigger one and this one says Anneke then we have got the pom-pom and on the other side you can see a huge Chanel perfume bottle I'm pretty sure that this is one it says number five I think Chanel has this kind of perfume and it's like a a kind of marblish thing so it looks like this one looks like marble and it's very nice and it is quite heavy by the way but it's so cute so this is the bag outside and let's see so we have got one pocket here in the front and I'm going to remove the papers that you could see how it looks inside and I'm also quite curious about it by the way um so let's see all the pieces yep and this is the inside and oh I'm I'd like to show you it's very nice I don't understand why is it upside down but <laughs> The material is upside down so you can see the Eiffel Tower and um, pieces about uh, Paris and what have we got oh so here you can have a pocket so here's a pocket you can put your thingies and it's quite big so it has got such a big um, place where you can put your things on the other side we have got another zipper and we can also have the straps so papers and more papers and more papers oh the compartment is quite big wow it looks so good and here you can also see that we have got another pocket with zipper and here is also an Anneke logo so this is how it looks and on the back you can also have an extra pocket where you can put something really tiny like a lipstick because this is the size of it so about this size it's a teeny tiny pocket yeah exactly just only for a lipstick <laughs> I think and here are the straps and uh, you can just put on you as a normal tiny bag or you can make it to a crossbody bag and this is what I love using and on the other side you can see that we have got some tags and this one is the logo and it says from to so if you give it as a present then you can write your name and everything on it and this is the other usual Anneke card 
oh my gosh so this is such a beauty i love this one and i think it it's worth the price because it is quite uh, good it's leather usually the prices are about 40 50 euros um, I think this is normal so every leather stuff what you buy also here in Hungary and they are about these prices and I have never ever seen anything like this one so detailed so I think this is pretty nice I'm going to check um, and write you here somewhere um, which year this was made this collection because what you should also know about these products that uh, they have got a uh, um, spring summer collection after that the autumn winter collection every year and they made just a few products so i don't know how many stores you can see in hungary there are a lot of online stores where you can buy leather products but there are always one or maybe two pieces of these the collection is quite huge you can still check on their website i was searching all the things what i wanted to know about this collection so that's why i know it and i completely recommend these i think these are such beauties and i hope i could help you with this video if you would like to look something uh, leather and good quality product for yourself so thank you for watching and have a nice day goodbye